rain showers tonight, and yes, a couple of snowflakes could mix in there as well. Well, this weekend is the Iowa Film Festival, which is pretty exciting it's in itself. Even more exciting, I'm joined this morning by filmmaker all the way from London, Martin Goosh. Good morning. Good morning. So tell me, you just flew in last night. You were here for the Iowa Film Festival. Tell me a little bit about the film that you're bringing here. Uh, well, uh, it's called The Search for Simon, and uh, it's uh, a, a British sci-fi comedy, a bit like Monty Python meets... Uh, Shaun of the Dead. Okay. Shaun of the Dead meets X-Files meets Monty Python. <laughs> That's Something a good like matchup. That. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, how, would you, how did you become interested in coming all the way to Iowa from London to do this? Uh, well, there's many film festivals all over the world, mm -hmm. uh, and I've been to quite a few of them, and I thought, this one looks really interesting. And I looked, you know, I hate to say it, but I looked on that big website thing, <laughs> with lots of those, and... Uh, Iowa it was fascinating. I've never really been through Iowa. Okay. I've been, been to LA and I've been to New York and I thought, let's try the middle. Right in the middle. That's yeah. where you're finding us today. So what did, what is it that drew you? You said you looked on the website, you thought it was interesting. What was it on the website that drew you to, to the Iowa Film Festival? I think it's, it's very exciting to come to places you haven't been to before. Yeah. And a lot of the film festivals around the world are, do feel a little bit the same. So coming to a historic city like Mason City, which is a little bit different, is a great attraction. And I know you have one part in this. Tell me a little bit about what's happening this weekend. It starts today, I understand. Uh, yes. Uh, well, I mean, we're just they're just showing lots and lots of films. And there's a bar. So <laughs> what more do filmmakers need? A, a cinema and a bar, that's it. That's it. Everything else is a bonus. That is fantastic. Your movie airs on, is that Saturday, right? Uh, yes, it's Saturday. On Saturday. Also on Saturday, the big award ceremony, SNL. Uh, Previous SNL cast member is going to be here as the awards host. Are you excited to see that? Do you know SNL Saturday Night Live? I'm aware of it, yes. Okay. Yeah, we're, we're, they used to show it in England, but it, they'd show it like four years behind what you were getting. So whatever you were showing, we hadn't got it. So you'll see him on your air in a couple yeah. of years yeah, then. That's Pretty fine. cool. But that'll be a lot of fun. Tell me what it is about um, films like you made and the films that we're going to see this weekend <laughs> that draw so many people out and that really kind of inspire people, I think, to make films on their own. I know everyone's kind of able to make a film on their iPhone if they want to anymore. Oh, absolutely. But. I think it's, it's the, the, the French call it the auteur, and it's the freedom to do whatever you want, because you know that if you, uh, if you go and see a studio picture, mm -hmm. it may have loads of effects and be very expensive and have all the best actors, but is it the vision of the voice or the of the director? Right. or not. Right. Whereas you know that if you're looking at uh, an independent film, a truly independent film, then that is exactly the piece of art, because it is an art form, that the creator wanted to make. It's exactly the same as if you went into an art gallery to see uh, a Van Gogh or a Da Vinci mm -hmm. and someone else had added bits at the bottom <laughs> because they thought it looked nice. Right. You see, well, so yours will look nice and it's all well. yours. That's it. It's ours. 100% original. I love it. All right. Well, search for Simon. This is movie. Lots of 40 other movies you can go see this weekend, too. So we hope yeah. you do. Thanks for coming in this morning. Hopefully you get adjusted to the sleep. Yeah, thank you very much. <laughs> and still to come this morning, if you're a bird watcher, you're going to want to see this.